Well, we just finished watching another classic, movie-wise. Uh, we just finished The Apartment. Um, Cody watched the back half of it with me. Uh, Billy Wilder movie from 1960, starring uh, Jack Lemmon and Shirley MacLaine. Shirley MacLaine? Yes. Yeah. I wanted to say a different name. I don't know why. Anywho, I really enjoyed this movie. Um, I feel like I related a lot to the main character, which is mostly why I enjoyed it. Um, we joked that he would be me in ten years if we had never met. Um, draining pasta in a tennis racket and whatnot. Um, Push over. Cody, what did you like about it? Um, <clears throat> I like Shirley MacLaine's hair. I know that's super shallow, but I loved that she had like the Peter Pan thing going on. Um, <clears throat> I really liked the writing. Um, because the characters all really stayed true to themselves until the pivotal final moment. Um, but you could still, like, see them evolving and, like, it was a lot of subtlety and older, it was a lot more like, this is the face I'm presenting, this is what I'm yeah. actually feeling, which is, like, a 50s thing. And the dialogue was, like, super witty. Which yeah. I always appreciate. That's something yeah. I wanted to say about All About Eve yesterday is that the dialogue is just fire. And like everything, it's not necessarily realistic, but this is part of that era of filmmaking where the dialogue isn't, it's not mammoth. It's not going to be how people actually talk. But it's like real quick witted, fast. What was that thing dance. that, even when it's like not necessarily like humorous, quick witted, it's still just like stabs you in the gut. Yeah, even very serious scenes had some just snappy dialogue I laughed at. I thought it was hilarious. Like, there's a suicide attempt in the middle of the film, and um, when the doctor comes in, he, he goes to the one woman who didn't attempt suicide, and he just says, no, the other one, and the doctor makes a face, and it's this great piece of humor in the middle of this really dark scene, and I appreciate it. There was another part where, um, before the suicide attempt, uh, the one woman, basically the guy just she gives him a thoughtful Christmas present, and he gives her a hundred dollar bills and tell a hundred dollar bill and tells her to buy something nice. Mm -hmm. And then she starts to strip, and he's like, "No, not tonight." And she's just like, "Oh, well, I figured as long as it was paid for." Yeah, it's and it's just oh, like snappy, really smart dialogue, and it's something we don't get too much in movies today, uh, which is really unfortunate because I I definitely appreciate it. Um, that's really all we got to say about the apartment. Um, tomorrow is another Suggestion Saturday. I still haven't figured out what movie I'm watching, so you'll find out what I do. <laughs>
go out there, do that weird little thing that you create, because they both want you to. Yeah. Um, so God bless um, all their families and everyone they left behind. Um, and thank you so much, both of you, David and, uh, and Alan, for everything you've given us, because it's, it's art. What, what they've done is art, and we, we just thank you.